don't know the secrets to getting agents to beg you to join their team or brokerage, there's actually three. If you're new, hi, I'm Melanie Suber. I already have financial freedom and now I wanna help you do the same. So this channel is all about leadership, recruiting for your team or brokerage, wealth building, strategies, all of that fun stuff. In this video, I'm gonna give you the three best tips for having inbound leads for your brokerage or team. Fun story. After Jordan and I got married, we went on a mini moon to a cabin in the woods for a week. And we had no cell reception, so we turned off our phones. And for a week, we just enjoyed each other and the post-marital bliss. And when I turned my phone on after that week, I had a email from EXP saying someone had joined and listed me as their sponsor, which means that they officially joined the Royal Circle and I didn't speak to them one time in the process. I had no idea who this person was. I just turned my phone on, saw this email. With EXP, the system is I get their phone number. So I texted him and said, hey, Jeff, that's his name, <laughs> saw you joined the Royal Circle, so excited. And he said, yeah, I saw your YouTube channel. Saw my YouTube channel, I never spoke to him. He liked what he saw. He did the entire application, he joined my team without me having to do a single thing. In fact, I was literally in the woods with my husband with no cell reception. So it's possible for me, it's possible for you too. And I'm gonna tell you the three best secrets for making that a reality. Now the first one is my favorite and it's a big one. It is be very visible. A lot of people don't want to talk about their team or brokerage. They think that recruiting is an ugly word. They think that agents don't wanna hear about it. They, all of these excuses that we have. But here's my thing. Every agent wants the best opportunity for them. And if you think that your team or brokerage is the best opportunity, which you should because that's why you're doing it, it would be a disservice to agents everywhere to not talk about that opportunity for them. It's probably the same thing, you've experienced this as a realtor. Some realtors feel uncomfortable, the secret agents, they don't like to market themselves online, they don't like to talk about real estate. There are people that are working with realtors that are less passionate, less informed, less excited about helping people, you fill in the blank, and it's because those people are more visible. So to not market yourself as a realtor, people are buying houses with people that don't even know you have to deliver the earnest money or something like that. So it's the same exact thing. There are agents everywhere. I talk to them every single day. Agents that say, my broker doesn't even talk to me. My broker hasn't talked to me in three months. Uh, we don't get any additional benefits like stock. We don't get healthcare. When I call my broker, he never answers. All of these things. There are people that are at a brokerage and they are unhappy and they are looking for your solution. So it is your job to make yourself visible. Now, what does that look like? everything. For me, social media is really big because it is evergreen. Making a YouTube channel means that I was able to be on my mini moon with my husband and have someone literally watch my videos, do the entire application while I didn't even talk to him. So YouTube is going to be my favorite. We also have master classes, all forms of social media, TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, you name it, you should be visible. You should be talking about what you offer your people. And if you need help with that, my next video is going to talk about that. So make sure you have hit that subscribe button so you can see when that one comes out. But you should be talking about how you can help agents all the time. Now in these, in these posts, whether it's an Instagram post or a YouTube video or a webinar that you wanna put up on wherever, you need to, number two, make it easy for people to do the next step. So for example, in this YouTube video, in my description, I have a masterclass that you can watch to learn more. I have a link to my calendar. So you wanna book a call and ask me questions and you wanna join my team, you can do that. I also have the link to the eXp application and the directions on how to choose me as your sponsor, which means that you get me as your coach, and you get all of the free resources, the trainings, the, the courses that we give for free, all of that stuff, you get that for free. I have all of that information in my description. I don't want someone to watch a YouTube video and be like, wow, Melanie's amazing, the Royal Circle sounds amazing, but how do I join? You wanna make it as easy as possible for them to do it. Take out the guesswork. Which brings me to my third tip, which is have a call to action. You wanna be very clear. I've said this in some of my other videos, if you've seen them, you're a rock star. You need to make that bridge in their brain for them. They might be watching your videos, they might be reading your posts, they may be thinking to themselves, wow, this person is so smart, I think I could really learn a lot if I joined this person at their team or brokerage, but unless you spell it out for them and say, click the link below to book a call, Click, a, click the link below to do the application to join me. Make sure to list Melanie Suber as your sponsor to get all these resources. Make sure to sign up for the masterclass to look below to learn the three biggest mistakes that all brokers and teamings are making when they're trying to grow their, their brokerage or team. Make the call to action so clear that people don't have to just think. You forget that, especially on social media, people are scrolling, people are doing a million things. If you don't spell it out clearly for them and 
tip number two, have it very easy for them. Have a link that all they need to do is click it and book a call on your calendar and then it's there. And once they booked it, have an email campaign so that they say, hey, our call is in 24 hours, don't forget. Hey, our call is in one hour, don't forget. You wanna make it so easy, so clear, so simple that a seven-year-old with internet access could go through the process. But tips two and three are extremely contingent on tip number one. So if you do all those three things and you do them with consistency, I promise you before long, people will be begging you to join your team or brokerage. And some of them, you won't even have to talk to them face to face before they join. If you found this video helpful, smash that subscribe button. I post new videos every single week, all things wealth building, mindset, leadership, all of those fun things and hit the little bell so you get all the notifications. I wanna see you in, I wanna see you change agents lives and I wanna help you achieve all of your dreams. Remember, you are all kings and queens and abundance is your birthright. I will see you at the top.